Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Sengoku Dynasty, where we left off looking for bamboo, and we still didn't find any. So we searched up here in the woods. I guess we can search down here by the water. And see if we can find any pine bush. Wait, what was that? Oh, no. Wait, I'll take some winterberry. Where's the winterberry? Oh, unripened fruit. Um, I don't see anything out there. I do see this red thing on the map above me. Maybe we just go see what that's all about. While we look for this bamboo. Entered... Injurio Rebels Region. Okay. Well, hopefully hopefully these rebels won't mind me being here. Ooh, what is this? Ooh, ooh, loot all. Transfer, take all. What do we got? Iron knife. Ooh, I want to take all. Yes, yes, yes. I can't take anything else, though. Isn't that a fishing rod? Why can't I take the fishing rod? It looks like there's somebody standing there. And there's somebody sitting over there. Let's go see this person. It's good to see a friendly face. What are you looking for here? The peasant kingdom. What else? Does it live up to people's expectations? Probably nothing can live up to the story told where I come from. A land of freedom and prosperity where no daimyo dictates what you should do. My mother believed every word of it. She told me to go and check what it is like, what is really like, and then perhaps come back here, come back for her. She died last winter. Why does it sound like something's coming up behind me? Please don't attack me. An old woman's fantasy, perhaps. We'll see. I hope you find a better fortune sooner or later. Why don't you come live with us? Sure. You could make a new home right here. So you could become... So this could become my new home? Sounds good, but where do I go exactly? Oh, goody. Oh, hey, right, 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 right. Where's my, where's my thing at? Wait. No, don't, don't make... Uh, stop hitting me. My health. Oh, where's my weapon? I forgot what slot it was on. Ah, there it is. Alright. What's wrong with me? Oh, is it the health? Oh, it's my stamina. Can I, can I just throw it at him and kill him? Oh, no, I can throw it out of the miss. I'm gonna get my butt kicked. I'm gonna, am I gonna die? All right, hold on, hold on. Where did I put this thing? On number five. I'm pushing every button trying to figure out where it's at. Maybe I'll leave that thing alone for now. You know what? I still want to see if I can get this. Oh, what? You want to attack me, do you? I'll skin it with a knife. I have a knife. Number four has a knife. Ooh, that's what I want to do. I want to skin it. Look, I'm skinning it backwards. That's my skill. Did I skin it? I got 11 pieces of meat. Uh, I guess. Yep, I skinned it. So our first boar battle. Our first anything battle. I'm taking this. Are you, you're not a bad guy. I don't see no things above you, so... Can I collect eggs? Harvest the nest? Okay, good. Pirate! The stories I could tell you. I am of the new settlers from Sosogi. I wanted to... 
Settlers? Settlers? What's the point? It's old people like me who have to settle. The young should listen to the call of the open sea. You used to be a sailor, right? Aye, we roam the seas from here to China, to Jasan in even. We're saying Jasun. Always faster than those who wanted to catch us. You used to be a pirate? A free trader. When the Chinese banned overseas trade, some of them realized that of all the dumb ideas of an imperial court, this was the dumbest. Weird people, these Chinese. Sailed with a lot of them. Some of them good as well. Anyway, they needed someone to conduct their trade. That's where we came in. Riches, slaves, you name it. Hell, we even got a commission from the highest ranking officials. Then they hunted us, and then they paid us. Okay. Those were wild times. The stories I could... Um, I'll listen to your stories some other time, old timer. What's the, what is the, what is the name of this village? Village is called Injero, after a great man. You know who he was? Of course you do. The leader of the first uprising against the cruel Shugagi. Shugai-dai. I am very much going to have to learn these words better. He was killed, but his legacy lives on right here. Uh, the memory of the sea. You should go sailing someday. Maybe I will. Maybe I'll just go over here and see if you got any goodies I can take. There's stuff right there. No, doesn't seem to be anything good I can take. So at least my health is going back up. But I still don't see any... Bamboo. Is bamboo rare in this game? I mean, somebody making jokes. I should port it over from um, Minecraft. You know how that works. Feathers, collecting eggs. Uh, it looks like there might be a shrine up there. This looks difficult to pass. Oh, there's something over here. Okay. I don't see... Let's talk to people. Bandit. What brings you here today, outsider? Some serious business, is a business, I hope. I am one of the new settlers. We wanted to live on a good terms with everyone here. Good terms, exactly. That's what I always seek. You're just starting out, so you'll be exempt from payment for a time. What do you mean? What payment? Good terms never come free. There's always some give and take involved. You'll learn that soon enough. Everyone here will want something from you. I will sometimes get... It will sometimes get complicated. With us, it's merciful, mercifully simple. You pay us, we give you no trouble. Mostly. Wouldn't you call that extortion? As long as you pay, you can call it whatever you like. Extortion, taxation, tribute, or token of friendship. This is my favorite. But for now, you have nothing to worry about. We welcome you, fr you, you in friendship. When the time comes, I will visit you to negotiate Toku's behalf. Toku's behalf. Wait, 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 wait. I'm not done with you yet. Uh, what kind of work do you do here? We're the protectors of the valley. We look after the locals and they give us stuff we need. Wood, food, and weapons. Some don't like it, but then we, we send someone to rough them up a bit. You know, for the good of the valley. Uh, of course. There's a bad group in them all. Nothing here for me to take, huh? What about you? Are you here about my father? Who is your father? Was, not is. So, it's not about him. Where are you from? 
I'm sorry. I'm one of the new settlers who stay in Susogi. I his gallows. I was born there as the one son of Ajiro Re the rebel. His grave is up there. You should pay go pay respects. How did you end up here? After father's death, I tried to live with my aunt in Arutanai, but then I met Tokuku. She helped me understand the situation in the valley. Father's legacy is not about preserving the twisted situation in the valley now. He loved freedom. There can be no freedom while the fat abbot at the temples bleed the valley dry with his taxes. Here, only Tokuku and her, her people are really free. That's why I'm here. Really? You're only free here? Look, you got some good stuff here. Let's loot this thing. I'm taking it all. Oh, I thought something was going to pop up and said I was in trouble. Is there anything else I can loot? If you're going to try to take from me, I'm going to take from you. Although I'd like to get some bamboo. I don't see any bamboo stuff I could take. And none of this is takeable. I'd like to get this bucket. Give me this bucket right here, man. I'm trying to make buckets. Oh, there's something back here. Look at this. What is going on? Bandit deputy leader. Looking for trouble, right? No. I'm not looking for trouble. Yes, you are. You just don't know it. I know your kind. Clueless, always poking their noses into other people's business. You never know when it's going to get too dangerous. Not that I'm complaining. I actually made good money off such people back in the day. What do you mean? I dabbled in slave trade when the, we uh, still had a lord. They were the easiest prey. Kidnapping for ransom was a little hobby of mine as well. I was, I was a respected trader, so it was tolerated. Tough trade. Tough trade, that. Not for the squeamish, but you learn to know people, really know them. Hmm, sounds like you were a hole. Oh, what's this? Bandit leader. Oh, it's an outsider. You honor us with your visit. Aha. Are you the leader here? Well, what do you think? Would a woman be able to keep order among these wild, unruly beasts? Of course I'm the leader. And do you know why? I wouldn't dare to guess. Good for you, because I'm much wilder than them. And they know it. If you work with me, I'll do anything to help you. If you cross me, you'll regret it. You regret you were born. So welcome to the rebel camp. What are you, what are you, what are you up to? Are you a free person or an agent of the monastery? Are you going to be friends or enemies? At all? I've got, I've got to go. I'll talk to you later. Hey, what was this? This place looks so calm. Expected something else? Okay. Nope. But do you have any goods I can take? Ooh. Okay, what is this? Cotton gloves. Unlocked trowel. Cotton gloves. Unlocked warming drink. So if you find certain items, you just automatically unlock them. What is this guy? General trader? Anything I can help you with? You're a trader, right? Surprised to find a trader in a bandit village? Well, you shouldn't be. It's business like any other. Yes, we get what we want by force when we need it. Most traders I know don't do that. Most traders you know are protected by lords and religious sects. And they use force much more than we do. So, what's the difference? Yes, from time to time we dump... What was that? From time to time we dump a few uncooperative pe peasants in a ditch. Sometimes in pieces. But they burn whole villages. So, who's the real bandits? Can I trade? Oh, yeah. Trade. Ooh, that's just all. Look at this. Chiseled stone steel. <laughs> so what is uh, the trades? I guess it's these right here. He's got 820. 
So, oh, bamboo. So if I did this. Oh, so I can only buy it with this item. How am I holding water? Cotton gloves used to protect the hands during work are 500. These are six. I could buy all the bamboo right here. Milt. 35. Parsley's two. One. Sticks are one. Eggs are five. I could get 50. <laughs> um, meat is 12. Go pick a whole bunch of unripened fruit. This gives you 500, though. Which makes me think maybe I shouldn't get rid of them, but then I would have a lot of coin to use. Hmm. You know what? I'm going to hold off. I'm not going to sell anything yet. Because I don't know. Get out of my way, leader. Deputy leader. I don't know if I'll find ban uh, bamboo out there anywhere, and I don't want to trade up anything. I don't need to talk to anybody else right now. You're a trader? Oh. Nola? Rice? Labash water bottle? All right. Curzon season has ended. Your villagers have finished production for the day and consume their daily needs. Okay. That kind of worried me for a second, but... And that means it's going to get dark. And I still haven't found any bamboo. Anything I can search over here? No. A nice little thing here. Let's go here. Okay, looks like a little prison for them. Isn't this the deputy leader? No, this is somebody else. Are you here about my... Oh, no, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Uh, clothes, take good care of the homes. Okay. There's some stones. But I don't see anything that might resemble bamboo. Oh, what am I doing? No, stop. Um, there is a fort looking thing over there. Let's go over there and see what that is. I'm being nosy. Cave entrance discovered. Guess there's a cave entrance down there. Maybe I should go in a cave and see if there's any bamboo in there. Let's go say hi to this. Hey, look, there's bamboo stuff. I could chop these down. Bandit, I bid you welcome to our village. Spoken like an elite warrior. I used to take offense at such remarks, but now I no longer care. Yes, I was in the service of the Lord once. His name does not matter now. Not since I found him in a pool of blood, a man entrusted to my care. So you're a ronin? Yes, masterless. Wandering the world. When I came here, I thought I had nothing to lose in having already lost my honor. But now I have a wife, Tama, a fierce warrior, and a daughter, little Yasu. Suddenly, I have a lot to lose again. I get it. Ooh, I can open, I can loot this. Okay, we're going to transfer all that. Sunken hearth and cooking pot. I'm learning all kinds of stuff from these bandits. Except I'm not learning bamboo, which is something I definitely want to learn. Oh, I just slid. Did I just, I slid. That was kind of cool. I should be able just to run across this, right? Because you don't sink. We never sink. There's another place up there. I probably could go up there and... Oh, I'm out of stamina. I gotta watch it. You'd figure that bamboo would be easy to come across, you know? But I'm not seeing any.
This is nice. Special projects. You will find a variety of special projects in the world. They represent the transportation, production, or spiritual infrastructure of Nada Valley. Completing them takes a lot of effort, but provides Dynasty XP and other rewards, like sources of rare resources. To, to start a construction process, build a special project construction workshop. Basic structures near the signpost. Okay. What does it say? Build a bridge? Construction workshop. Nesson. No, that's just what it just told me to do. I see that tree. There's a house right there. Let's just go up here and see what's up. Small construction site. Maybe that's... Oh, I do got to build a bridge. Maybe this is a special project. And if I try to jump across, can I get on the rope? Nope. Can't get on the rope. So I have to build that to get across because I'm pretty sure I can't jump it. Okay. Hmm, there's some special projects in my future. But before we go, I want to go over here and look at this. This looks like a nice house to visit. Oh, here we go. Shinto Priestess. If you want something, you should speak to my mother. And who is your mother? Hokuku, the leader of this village. She makes a, all the decisions. I serve the kami. Isn't this uh, her mother? That's, her ch that's his child, right? Like Ronin? Which spirits do you serve? Oh, the great sea serpent himself, Raijin. He's a, he has a shrine nearby. The people here don't seem to be the devout kind. Oh, you'd be surprised. The ruler of the sea is a model for who we are here. He can be benevolent, like when he helped the poor hunter Hori. Or crafty, like when he stole Kamamatari's jewel. Kamamatari's jewel. Right now, he is very angry. What makes you think that? A couple of moons ago, he came in a storm and destroyed the path leading to his own shrine. That's his power. He knows when to give and when to take, and he will not be controlled. Shouldn't a path be rebuilt? We didn't want to go against his will, but some time has passed. Maybe it's time. Are you offering to help? Yes, I wouldn't mind a powerful ally. Good, but be careful. You have to make sure to let Raijin know you're recognizing his recognize his power. I suggest you use a Gohi, Gohi wand to cleanse the spiritual po uh, pollution at the construction site. Gonna talk about perhaps I'll talk to your mother. Have a good day. Okay. Anything good in here? Nothing, nothing. Uh, wait a minute. I got a... Zero. Then. Torch! Let's just wander around the forest for a while. Oh, look, a rabbit. Ah, uh, that's a bandit. That's a bandit. Um... What was it? Where's my stash? All right, dude, let's do this. No, no, wait a minute. I forgot what I was. No, no, wait. Oh, okay. Uh, wait a minute. Aim block. Oh, left, left alt is blocked. Ah. Oh, I parried that one. Oh, my stamina is gone. That's why I can't parry. All right, Carlet, let's do it. Oh, I should have got him. I beat him. I'm taking all your goodies, buddy. And then I did take a small go. He won. Oh, no, that was from the other girl. Um, I just 
All I got was a wooden staff. Really? Kinda sucks, doesn't it? All right, let's go back to my torch. She shells on the seashore. She shells. She shows by the seashore. And I, there's probably some kind of use for these. Sometimes contains pearls. They sell pretty good, huh? Maybe I should use these for trades. And go back and buy that bamboo, you say? Huh? You guys are so smart. I'm telling you. That's actually a brilliant idea. Let's go collect some more seashells and get back to that trader. So there was two bandits over there, but right now I want to sell, oh look, a pearl. Oh yes. Let's sell all of them. Okay, so now I got 700, I'm buying bamboo. I'm buying all of it. I'm buying all of it. Now we have bamboo! Should I wear these gloves? Uh, of course, I can't wear the gloves. What do I gotta take these off and put these on? Oh yeah, I guess so. Alright, let me run back over to the base. Let's make, I gotta make some straw, then I gotta make, oh, I gotta make three straw, and one more, we'll make a torch, got the torch going into, that's, okay, good, now let's go in here, where's the one it needed, oh, I gotta equip it, don't I, so I gotta put the hammer on, and you needed the bamboo, Yay! Beverage storage is complete. What just happened? Unlip unripened fruit has lost its freshness. I guess it was nighttime and now I have not slept. I have started over. That's good. I gotta build some more houses so people can have places to sleep. Um, oh, yeah, we got to go in here in the storage. So we can drop this off. And we'll put some more sticks in there. This is food. For a cooking pot. Right, cookies require the construction of advanced campfires and hearths. Uh, I will need that later on. Bamboo, probably. Cooked meat. Grass, stone jug. Gabo, this has rotted, so put that in there. Stack that with that. Do you put water in here, I guess? Yeah. It's raining inside my little... Yeah. All right, so we're going to drop off some cooked fish. Oh, you know what? Let's cook some... Uh, let's cook the fish. Where's... Uh, I can cook a bunch of it. Cook, uh, cook a bunch of this, and then cook up the meat. Hopefully people won't be up too upset. You look like you're just walking around chilling, woman. What are you doing? Taking a bath? Ooh. Oh, I can make 39 of these? Ooh. Give me a second. So I have cooked up all the foods. Now we're going to store them in here because 
You know what? I'm going to eat my own steak. Restore this. And we'll put all this food in here for them to do whatever they want to. Look, at there's 25 of those gobbo things in there. We've got some meats. We've got some berries. We're in, uh, we're in really good shape here. Look, we got plenty of food. Hopefully, that's enough for them. We just have to keep finding food for them. All right. And then I want to put this on number seven. Healing. Wait, healing bomb? What is that? Food loss, but health gain. Eh, okay. We'll put this in. No. Hey, what just happened there? Maybe I split it by accident. Uh, sticks. I'm not. Oh, that's what I'm doing. I'm splitting it. I'm hitting it. Right, so I still got these and this iron knife. I want to hold on to. We will eventually go back up and do that. But what I need to do is build more houses. And let's put the hammer on. Basic camp structures. So we have campfire with a cooking pot now. We'll hold off on that one. Uh, what do we got over here? We have small architecture. Yeah, I'm not worried about small architecture. Trowel, a simple wooden outdoor water container. Any debark. So wait a minute. This is just, just water for outside for animals, right? Or any a cart. Around this wooden cart, decorate your village and make the place a little bit busier. No. Um What do we got over here that's new? Production buildings. Kitchen furniture. All furniture that can be built in a kitchen building, like Sunken Hearse and Dynasty Food Storage. Ah, okay. Oh, wait, there's something else back there. What was it? Beds, fireplaces, tables. Uh-huh. Look at this. We're, we're coming along now. Uh, we, wait. I don't want decorations, though. I want... Buildings. Storage buildings, house, houses, production buildings, service buildings. Services to your villages. I can't do nothing on that one. This one, I got the forger. I'm going to use to collect plants like herbs, mushrooms. Ooh, I should do this one. All right. Without much effort. We can post forge jobs. Ooh, let's do that. Where could we put this thing? Like right here? No, because there's a fence there, Mike. Let's put it here where there is no fence. This is a good idea to put this here. All right, what do we need here? Any logs? Wait, how am I doing it without... Oh, is it because it's in my inventory? I get to do it automatically? That's awesome. That means I'll have to go collect logs. I like that. If I put it in my, inv my storage thing, it automatically works? That's awesome. All right, let's get these steps. Forging might be nice, because that'll give some herbs and other stuff. Maybe even some automatic... Yeah, my stamina. Let me finish building this real fast.
think I got this done. Uh, the only reason I say I think is usually there's like a, a sound when I complete something, but it didn't make much of a sound this time. So let's go, let's see, we got... General storage access. Uh, we can sleep. Forger. Okay, so now I got to assign a forger. Uh, select a recipe. Uh, I don't think it really matters, does it? Let's go with bark. And, um... You know what? Let's make... You know what? Let's not make bark. Let's, uh, let's take bark off. How do I take bark off? Let's, uh, recycle bark. Um... Where's this? Oh, gabos, eggs, and wineberry, because it's all food, right? And foster refinement. Uh, maybe I should put something else in there. And, uh, we could collect sticks and grass and grass all right so now there's a lot of stuff to do in here how do i sign okay so good working table forger so he's not doing anything there wait i want to assign him so instead of doing you on a word working, let's do you on a, no, let's go, how do I do this? Change jobs, forger, yes, uh, Gabo. Okay, so the green means there's somebody doing this, right? So he's doing a forger hut. Akio is supposed to be doing compost, but we're gonna do a forger on you too. Because, does this mean they just do, oh yeah, let's do this, oh I see it, workload, okay. Uh, you know what? I'm not really worried about sticks. Let's remove sticks and let's remove grass for now. That should be good enough, right? Because this is all food. Uh, let's do 15. All right, cool. Available production consumes. So they produce that much food. Cool. So they now produce food. Which means I can mill I can build another house or two, probably two. I just I need a bucket on this one yet. That's what I need to do. And I wonder if these wine berries. Oh, collected wine berries. Yeah, there we go. Why are you messing with me? Babos. And let me eat some food real quick. And I want to put all of this in here. Because when you put stuff in there, it works for everything. So I would need to build another house. Let's take this one down. And I think we could probably put two houses here, right? All right, this harvesting takes stamina? Nope. Just walk around here and clean up some grass. I wonder if somewhere along the line I need to... I don't want that grow there, grow in there. Like, see the bamboo grass? Does it grow up to be bamboo? Do we have to plant it somewhere along the line to get bamboo? Can't believe bamboo is hard to find. All right, we'll get this nice place cleaned up. Here we go. That looks brilliant. That looks brilliant. Let's go put in 
two houses, buildings, houses. All right. So let's put one in right about your villagers have finished production today. Okay. Uh, right there. And can I put one on this side? One. I mean, I can put one on this side. I don't want it to look all crappy. Yeah, that should be fine. I did collect a lot of logs, so we should be good on that kind of stuff. Hopefully. Let's build this one up. Probably going to end up needing more logs. <laughs> Collected a lot of sticks. All right, let me build the walls and stuff. All right, I got the two more houses built. And let's go through this real quick. Need to find some place to put up some lights. All right, so let's stick all of this, all this good stuff in here because we will be using it again later on, obviously. Oh, that's bamboo. Okay, so we're good on everything here. I don't have to worry about any foods, but now I have to go and assign population. Why is he unemployed? Oh, I have to assign this to each of them? Okay. So now they're both. I'm going to sign a home. Uh, I could do. Look, I could, I could do all kinds of stuff here. This one already has one. The workshop doesn't. I'll take. There we go. Now I have a home. So I've got two people. So let's talk to, I want to help the people around here like you advised. I haven't heard anything new about your efforts. I'm sure if you have helped some of the people I mentioned, All right? There are people that we need to get in here and then wait, which house is mine? Oh, that's yours. Well, I'm sleeping here then. Dang it. Uh, you will wake up in the morning. Okay, good. Get a little bit of rest. Wake up in the morning. Eat some gabo. I'm good doing that. Alright, we don't need any more of these torches. What we gotta do is find these people. So we got an explanation point right here. There were some people we wanted to invite to the village. So we gotta go get them real quick. And what was you? I can't remember what your quest was. What's your profession? I preserve the sanctity of the village and keep the spiritual pollution at bay. Burials, animal carcasses, removing large boulders, you name it. A lot of dirty work. Some call me all my lot impure, and I take pride in it. The Shobi said I might need some help. With old Hikoboe, with old Hikoboe, well... You're too late. He's drawing his last breath in Taro's cabin. He's beyond help. Shouldn't you be helping him? No use now. I just have to wait. And when he's ready, I'll drag him out into the sunlight. I came here from Sigi to perform this sacred duty. The gods don't like it when a man dies at home. So I'm sitting here listening to the sea with one ear 
on his groans one ear and his groans in the other. What's Hiboki's story? He refuses to leave Sasogi when his house burned down. Karo offered, offered to take him in and Hokobai's family moved to Arun Arantani. They are running out of food there, but they still keep bringing him rice. Old Hikoboi never wanted to be a burden, so he went into the forest and gathered some mushrooms. Turns out it was the wrong sort of mushrooms, and look where it got him. What was he thinking trying unknown mushrooms? Unknown? Not really. I think he did it to himself on purpose. What? How do you know? He opened his eyes for a moment and I swear he was relieved to see me. He knew it meant he was dying. Why would he do that? One less mouth to feed for the family. Food is scarce around here. Like I told you, he never wanted to be a burden. So there's really nothing we can do? No, but Mara would probably say otherwise. She's a local herbalist. I don't really trust her. She likes to play with herbs and mushrooms a little bit too much. You never know what will happen if you drink, if you drink her concoctions, but some of them can be helpful. I'll give her that. I'll talk to her. It never hurts to try. Oh, sometimes it really does. Uh, uh about Mata. Have you talked to her? Not yet. Try take your time. Are you good for you? <laughs> Taking your time? Are you good for you? Just don't expect Kaboki to stick around much longer. Gotta go. Talk to you later. Okay, so I got him. There's a bunch of question marks over there. Are these bad guys? Uh, yes, they are. And where was my staff on nine? I gotta remember this kind of stuff. Oh, there's a, there's a few of them. Oh, there's two of them. I don't want to fight two. I have yet to fight two. All right, let's do this. Let's just see what happens. Oh, ho, you're not. Oh, I forgot to block that. Oh, I hit the wrong button. No. Stop hitting the wrong button, Mike. Mike. Oh. Oh, my goodness. I got stuck in the menu and I couldn't get out for some reason. Oh, I'm going back over there. I'm gonna kick your freaking butts, man. Hey, look, my health is low. Dang it. I was hitting left alt and I hit the tab button with left alt and I got stuck. What is this? Bandit gloves? Put those in there. No, I don't want that. And where is that health? So health gain, food loss, use, use, and use. Now I'm starving. Oh, I used up all my health or my food. Sorry, guys. I'm going to have to eat some foods. Uh, I'm going to eat a lot of foods here. Okay, so I'm good on foods. I'm good on that. All right, let's go back over there and kick their ever living tails. And I got to remember do this, not this. Do this, not this. All right, dash is left control. I don't want to throw it. Oh, are you guys just still standing there? So can I kind of take him out while you guys just stand there? Let's see. You guys ready to see if this will work? Come here, big guy. Ooh, you're a dodger. I'm just going to keep nailing you. Ooh. Okay. Okay. No, Mike. Dang it. All right. All right. All right. 
it. Stop! I keep doing it. I'm just gonna take the hits. Oh! I don't even know what I got there. What is this? Miniature stupa. Mystical. The Buddhist structure exuding tranquility and spiritual entry. Perfect for meditation decor. Food loss, health gain. Wait, how is this food health gain? Okay, so my health is a little low. Tear down a cage with an axe. It's good to see a friendly face. What's your story? I had to leave my village. What happened? It got burned to the ground. My home, my fields, all gone. It's common theme. I had to find a new beginning. Why not here? I hope you find fortune soon. Why not come live with us? Uh, you could, you could settle in one of the villages there. So, this could become my new home. Sounds good. But where do I go exactly? Uh, we're almost ready for you to become a village. So, what's his name? Kairatu. So I go to my dynasty, I go to my village, refugee, assign a home, and you can be in this small hut. And then you are unemployed. I will sign at a job. Bob, 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 bob. Farmer as a sign. You know what? I'm just going to assign him there. And we'll do that. How's that? Hope you settle in nicely. Finally, an end to my wandering. All right, now we got to go take care of these two fools. Uh, maybe I'll find a pearl. But I only want one of them to come at me. So if I can get close enough to just have one. Let's see if I can get him to go this way. There you go. Come on over, big boy. Give me that rock, by the way. Come here. Come on. Oh! Look, I'm gonna throw a thing at him. Ooh. You're not like your knife captain, dude, man. He's he was whack hard. All right, so take all and let's get moving. Uh, okay, come here, big boy. What are you doing? Oh! <sighs> God, man. All right. Let's go back over here real quick. And what's this right here? Stone jug. This. Bandit clothes. Let's throw all this stuff in here. And one armor. Oh, this has got much better armor. This is three six. Three six. So it's still good enough. And I'll throw you in there. So I broke my other one. Or I lost it. So I have no more health? Is there nothing that gives me health here? Wait, what is this? Hunger gain, food loss. Uh, I'll eat some of these. All right. So I have to be careful now. Let's go over here and take care of this fool. <laughs> Roll my mouse wheel. He beat me up. Thought he was a punk, but I don't think he is. So I got to take him out. All right, big guy, let's do this. Oh, yeah. 
<laughs> really? I don't get anything back from that dice set. I said it's a nice for game the chance. And then water is a So the money I lost is just gone, obviously. Is there anything over here I can take? Can I get anything from this stuff? No. Yeah. It's not it's not breaking the axe and it's not breaking that stuff down. <sighs> what the heck? Well didn't see that when he first was there. Get more some more of these seashells. Pay back some money I lost. Maybe I'll get lucky and get a pearl. Pearls. Oh look, there's a bunch of she shells over here. And in rocks. Because I also need rocks too. Look at all these beautiful she shells. Let me collect these real fast and go back to the base. I got everything dropped off. I collected a lot of rocks, a lot of stones. We got seashells. Uh, I guess there's a way to crack them open. I got 156 stone. That helps me out a bit. Oh, I should keep this over here. I don't want both of them. And I think I'm doing pretty good right now. My health is going back up. Um, gotta go. Talk to you later. I still got to find other people, and there's a bunch of explanation points up on my map here. I got two of them. Let's just go over here. I've already got a lot of time, but I think... Didn't I have a place? I've got to go. I'll talk to you later. Okay, what about you? Good day. Talk to you later. Who knows? Maybe another traveler wander around and wish the famous key. Yeah, okay. So these two I'm not bringing into my village for some reason. And I guess I have to go up that way next episode. I hope you guys have enjoyed this. Like, subscribe, comment. Let me know what you think. Uh, this episode was fun. We bought our ba bamboo because we couldn't find the bamboo. And maybe I'm getting some stuff out of here. Nope, I guess not. Eh, well, we'll figure out how that works eventually. So until next time, look to the left for the previous episode. Look to the right for other series I'm doing. And uh, I hope you see you guys later. Bye-bye.